Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this session, I am going to discuss jQuery DOM traversing. Let's see. So there are various methods. Get by index, get by filter, get by find. Let's see each example one by one. Get by index. Test div li equal zero. That means select the first element, first li of test div. Add class selected. Then get by filter. Simply. You can filter based on the parameter passed. Here what we are using test div dot li dot filter dot middle. That means select based on the class middle. Add class highlighted. Then get by find. Here we are finding based on my condition span. It will check what the tag type. Span is tag type. It will find the span within the li. Then add class error. Let's see these examples in action. Here we have a div, test div. We have ul, li, top, middle, 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 bottom. Then list item one, two, three, up to six. Where list item six has a span in it. No other list item has span. So this is my DOM structure. This is my style sheet, which says error is red, selected is blue, highlighted is background color yellow. Let's see the output. First one, get by index. It says select the first li. Add class selected. So selected is blue. Here we see. So first item is selected. It is blue, right? Then let's see another condition says filter. Then choose middle. Add class highlighted. Okay, middle one should be highlighted. Highlighted is yellow. So middle are now yellow. Middle is basically class. So you have put all the list items which are having class middle. They are yellow. Then comes your last get by find find span add class error in this case any span is lying within li make it red so what we are doing here we are doing exactly the same this span is part of li so we are making it red let's see the next example each selector this is another important selector what it does basically each have multiple conditions in each you can have Say colon first child. In A, you can have style class as well. Middle zero, middle one, middle two, multiple classes. In A, you can contain condition as well. Say contains contains item five. So these conditions are used. Let's see this in action. We have a DOM specified like ul dev dev ul li class top middle zero one two bottom. Then we have a list item one to five. My message is a paragraph which will show. Okay, this is a particular list item. Let's see what I am doing in my document. Dot ready here. Li dot click function. Li dot click says when a li is clicked. Say I am clicking on list item one. Then what will happen? It will check the code is checking. Dollar this current element is first child. If the current element is first child. Okay, show a message that this is the list item one. Then, if the li clicked is of style class middle zero, middle one, middle two, then show the message this is middle class list. In case the current element clicked is containing item five, so if I click on list item five, my message would be its fifth list. Let's see these examples. Practical. In this example, we are going to cover DOM traversing. So, how our DOM is constructed right now? We have a div, then we have an unsigned list and li list item with class top as the first item. Middle is on the middle items. Bottom is on the last item. So, in our traversing, we have seen like in our script, we have test div parent li. So, we are up to this test div and li. Then we are checking the first item using eq operator, eq function of jQuery eq zero. So zero is the index. Now what we are doing here? Add class selected. Selected color is blue. So our list item one will be colored blue. Next we are filtering based on the middle class, which is applied on inner list items. We are adding class highlighted, which is yellow, having background as yellow. Last is like find span in the li. 
only last ally has span so we are adding class error here so it would be red let's see the output here here first item is blue middle items have background yellow last item is 6 let's move to next example we have more filters like is 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 a generic generic function it can accept a selector like first child it can check style class as well is middle 0 is middle 1 is middle 2 which are style classes or we can have functions like contains text like item 5 so in this case we have our DOM which was simpler like DOM unsigned list li list item 1 to 5 we have classes top middle 0 1 to bottom then what we are doing here in case of when li is clicked whenever any li is clicked we are checking whether this li which was clicked is first child is having style class middle 0 1 2 or contains item 5 so i can identify li using its item 5 using its style class or its the first child so let's see the output of this script here I have five items. When I click on list item one, it gives me list item one. When I click on list item two, it prints this is middle class list. When I click on list item five, it says it's the fifth list. 